This is Bulgaria Today. With the Cold War but a dim memory, the Bulgarian capital Sofia is now one of Eastern Europe's most cosmopolitan cities. And the people? No longer satisfied with their old world ways, life in Sofia is firmly planted in the 21st century. And when it comes to beauty, their new methods have gained the attention of the entire world. Meet Dr. Nikolai Surdev, one of Bulgaria's leading cosmetic surgeons and the inventor of the world-famous Surdev Suture. The cosmetic surgery methods are different. Um, as you, you can see, uh, we use punctures or uh, we do the same inside with suture. Plastic surgery involves cutting the skin open and reshaping the patient. But Dr. Surdev's approach is much less invasive. We uh, have to uh, lift, we have to, uh, to move the, the tissue from one place to another place and we have to suture it uh, on, stable, on stable tissue. Uh, so that we do it, but we don't open the skin in order to uh, reposition the things inside. We do it through small punctures. This is Marietta Dimitrova. She's about to get a nose job without having her skin cut or nose broken. I think that new techniques, modern medicine, can make me more beautiful without difficulties of traditional surgery. In fact, Dr. Surdev is so popular in Bulgaria, one of its top television personalities had a head-to-toe, full-body cosmetic makeover live on national TV. When uh, Dr. Surdev suggested me this uh, to make in life, I was agree because uh, I thought that that would be good for my health, for my form, and uh, will be interesting for our viewers. I thought that, that will be useful because uh, when they see how the, the, your form is uh, changed in life, you will believe that you could be the, it could be the same with you. It would be possible. Tanya's televised surgery did inspire other Bulgarians, women like Marietta Dimitrova. I feel bad about my profile because of the nose. And I think when I change this, I'll be more confident and feel much better. Before Marietta's cosmetic nose job, Dr. Surdev performs a small adjustment to her chin. We are looking for the golden dividing proportion. That uh, aesthetics is uh, made by, by the old uh, aliens or uh, the Greeks now. Uh, so that uh, the real proportion is equal, three equal parts of the face. Uh, when the nose is longer, uh, the lower part becomes smaller. In this case, we had even longer uh, lower part. One of the keys to Dr. Surdev's approach is the use of cosmetic threads. What we wanted uh, from uh, in our surgeries is a semi-elastic thread that is making not too much trauma, that is a little bit thicker, uh, cannot cut the tissue and uh, it has also an antimicrobial agent inside so that it's working against infection. Dr. Surdev moves on to Marietta's nose. Another author's uh, method is uh, uh, from uh, my things are the, the movement of the columella. Columella is this, uh, like a column. It's a column that holds the nose. And this columella can be moved forward or backward in order to uh, make a projection of the tip. Uh, and uh, what I have done else uh, with uh, the lady is uh, because one nostril was too long, I have sutured the nostril back to the, uh, to the septum. And so that uh, now she has equal nostrils. Um, I prefer uh, simple things that work, uh, instead to cut the nostril, to uh, put it on a new position. 